avoiding chaos and confusion. Baltimore City Housing is turning to technology as it opens the waiting list for Section 8 vouchers. The waiting list for Section 8 vouchers has been closed for over a decade. Yeah, it's a long time. It will reopen in just over two weeks. And if you don't know, those vouchers are to help the low income or elderly afford decent housing. And to avoid the long lines, Baltimore Housing wants applicants to go online. 11 News reporter Barry Sims is live at City Hall in downtown Baltimore. Barry. Done and stand. Applications can be done on computer or on a smartphone. And that's all starting October 22nd. Housing officials think that putting the process online is the most efficient way to help the most people. They just don't want to create a situation that has happened in other cities. Thousands braved the stifling heat in Atlanta back in August 2010. It's cold out here. And last year in Chalmette, Louisiana, hundreds waited in the rain. In both cases, all they wanted was to get on a waiting list for federally subsidized Section 8 rental vouchers. This is a very difficult um, uh, process to begin with, and we don't want to put through pe people through a lot of drama and a lot of turmoil. So Baltimore City is ditching the paper applications and relying on technology. From October 22nd through October 30th, city leaders are encouraging families in need to apply online. The most basic need any family must have is a safe place to call home. And for far too many of our residents, a safe and affordable home remains out of reach. The voucher program was last opened back in 2003. It took over 10 years to get through that list. Housing officials say even with this new opportunity to get assistance, they know the demand for affordable housing will be greater than the supply. We have, just to give you a sense, about 800 vouchers per year that will be available. So, um, you know, you'll, you'll, you'll get to apply, but that doesn't mean there's immediate relief. You never give up. You never give up. From his West Baltimore home, 59-year-old Henry Wheeler tells us about his dream of winning a Grammy and going through tough times while waiting eight years to get a voucher. It was, it was rough because I was moving all the time. I mean, I had to stay with family for a little bit. And then um, um, I, I finally got a little place and lost a job. I had to end up going into a shelter. The single father says the voucher has been a blessing for his family. It, it can help you get on your feet a little bit because I'm looking to get on my feet where I, I can just move out and open it up for somebody else that needs it. Now, the housing commissioner says everyone who applies will get equal consideration. A computer will randomly select where applicants are placed on that waiting list. Reporting live from downtown Baltimore, Barry Sims, WBAL-TV, 11 News.